everyone so uh, recently i just created a video on this topic where i showed that how you can solve this error code 268 and most of the audience problem solved using that trick that i showed in that video but some of them were requesting to come up with a new method of how to solve this issue so i come up with another method that worked again for me and I'm exactly going to show you how you can solve this issue. So once you are playing the game, the message pop up that disconnected. You have been kicked due to unexpected client behavior and showing that error code to 6 set. And there is an option to leave the game. So I will show you exactly how you can solve this issue in a step by step method. So if this video works for you, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel as I will be coming up with these methods again. So let's jump straight into the video. Okay, so first of all, just go to your desktop home page, and once you are there, just press Window plus R and a run command will pop up in front of you. Then type here percentage app data percentage. Once you do this, just click on OK. Once you are on this page, you can see that there is an option of app data at the very top where I showed the arrow. Just click on that button. Now click on local. Now you need to look at the Roblox folder over here. Just look at that folder and double tap over here and then just open that folder now once you are here just uh, click the three files that is at the very top bottom just select these three files and delete them the next step is to double tap or uh, go to the variant folder that is shown over here now again click on the second folder that is being shown by an arrow just double tap over there now right click on app settings and delete this as well once you do this just close all the windows and now we need to open the internet settings so for that just click on the very bottom side where it shows the icon of internet so just right click over there and select open internet settings now click on change adapter settings and now it is showing me all the internet adapter that is available on this device but as I am using the Wi-Fi device, so I need to click on Ethernet. You just right click over there and now click on Properties. And once you are here, just double click on Internet Protocol Variant 4. And now we need to type the DNS server over here. So just type exactly what I am typing here. 11111001. So this would be our DNS server that I am typing manually. So now once you click on OK, it will start to analyze the problem that is in your computer. So just be patient for some time and it will analyze the, all the problems and will show you the results. And now once the process is run, just close all the windows. And now it's done. We just need to go again to the Roblox uh, website and then uh, we let's say i just want to play among us uh, this time so just click on that and now you you know and now you need to download this app again so just click on download and download this software once the roblox is downloaded you just need to follow the steps to install this and once you do this just open it and let me show you that exactly uh, now it is not showing that same error again and now again go to roblox and click on among us and now let's uh, this time click on play and now as you can see that it is showing starting roblox and now finally the game is loading and as you can see that the same error is not showing again i hope you find this video helpful and if this trick work for you don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel i see you in the next video